Today has been a very bad day for Marvel Studios, but it's been years in the making. All through Phase 4 and the beginning of Phase 5, fans have been critical, fans have been complaining, fans have been talking about something being wrong with Marvel. And all along the way, they were protected by the mainstream media. Oh, well, if you don't like this you're just a toxic fan. If you don't like this character, you're just a sexist, you're just a racist, et cetera, et cetera. All while the box office results were dwindling and all the garbage they put on streaming continued to fail. Well, all that has now changed. We're starting to see the mainstream media go out and expose some of the behind the scenes chaos that's been going on at Disney, at Marvel Studios for years. And one of the biggest things that was revealed in this big piece by Variety today was about the Blade movie. The Blade movie that already some of the stuff we knew about it had been disastrous. It'd been delayed several times. It had like five different writers, multiple different directors attached to this series. And the star, Mahershala Ali, had reportedly threatened to leave the project entirely. Well, now something else has been revealed about all the behind the scenes drama surrounding Blade. And it's almost a meme at this point. And if it wasn't Disney, if it wasn't 2023, I might think this was a joke, especially considering the South Park joining the Pandaverse special we just saw. But no, this is legit. 2025 Blade movie gets concerning update, according to report. Well, you know what that report says? One person familiar with the Blade script changes said the story at one point morphed into a narrative led by women and filled with life lessons with Marashal Ali's Blade relegated to the fourth lead. You're going to do a Blade movie and he's going to be the fourth most important person in it and it's going to be about women. This is full MCU. The fact that this was an idea, the fact that a script got made like this, that Marashal Ali reportedly was just like, no, I'm fucking done. If this is what you're doing, I'm fucking walking. And they ended up getting rid of a director, getting rid of the writing team and rebuilding it from scratch. I I saw Drunk 3PO tweet this out. Put a chick in it, make her lame and gay. That's basically the approach across all aspects of Disney right now, including Marvel, apparently. Let's get into this. Blade movie gets concerning update, according to report. Blade hits another bump in the road. According to Variety, the MCU's Blade film continues to be in trouble at Marvel Studios. The Marashala Ali blockbuster has reportedly been sent back to the drawing board for another rewrite, this time headed up by Logan writer Michael Green. The project has now gone through five different writers and two directors, with word that Ali was set to leave the project before this latest rewrite. This comes as Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige has been reworking projects in the MCU amid widespread criticism of the super-powered franchise. Blade, which is currently set to debut sometime in 2025, will also sport a reported budget of $100 million. That's shockingly low. And one of the things it tells you is probably they have no faith in anything actually making money regarding that. They have no faith that this project is going to come around, but it's not something they can just straight up cancel like everything else because of how hard they virtue signaled. Oh, guys, look, we're bringing another black character into the MCU. You can't just cancel that. The Marvel Cinematic Universe can't just cancel something like that when they've been preaching about diversity. Uh, But let's continue on. In Variety's reporting, the outlet noted a previous version of the Blade script. And let's go to the actual article so we can get this entire thing. One person familiar with the script permutations said the story at one point morphed into a narrative led by women and filled with life lessons. Blade was relegated to the fourth lead. A bizarre idea considering the studio had two-time Oscar winner Ali on board. Amid exits that Ali was ready to exit over the script issues, Feige went back to the drawing board. $100 million for that is, again, shockingly low. When we're finding out that things like She-Hulk cost $225 million. When Secret Invasion cost $212 million. Streaming disaster shows. Yet the Blade movie... Only a hundred million. Now, who knows how much they've already spent on the multiple different iterations of this thing. But that's what they say they want to spend on it, at least according to this article. Uh, This shit, you you can't make it up. You cannot make this up. Hey, guys, we've got a fan favorite character that's going to get their own solo movie. We're going to make it all about women. And Blade isn't going to be an important character. Are you fucking kidding me? It's actually the meme. It's the meme from South Park just a couple days after they put out the Joining the Pandaverse special. This is wild, but this is the Marvel Cinematic Universe, and that's why it's all crumbling. And that's why even the Access Media 
has been forced to start mocking them and ridiculing them and exposing them for how bad they're failing right now. Let me know what you think about the newest update to the Blade disaster in the comments section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.